It is an extension of who you are. If people see that your content is consistent, they're going to see you as a consistent person. You're dependable, you're hardworking. This is what I believe. I'm sharing that with you for nothing. Just get out there and succeed. Right at the end of 2007, um, before I got laid off from the oil rig, I was, like I said, dabbling back into real estate. And I did something that was just the most amazing thing. And I still do it to this day. And it's literally the foundation of my business and the reason why I'm able to sell so much property. But I started doing a weekly email. Every single week, on the same day of the week, and I'll do it forever. And what it was is I started communicating with potential buyers and sellers in the market. And there were so many foreclosures going on at the time. There were so much, you know, so many deals and foreclosures and stuff that was so much cheaper. And so I heard it so many times that they wanted a weekly report of the foreclosures or the, the deals. They wanted a weekly list, weekly list. And so many, so many people told me that I started sending out this weekly list of foreclosures and deals in the area just to the people who asked for it. And after like a month of doing that, I said, you know, I'm just going to send this to everybody, all, everybody in my database. And so then as the years went on, I just continued, you know, collecting people's email addresses, putting people in this email database. And as time went on, the foreclosures eventually went away and my weekly email just kind of morphed into a weekly report, you know, weekly market report. And I create it every week. It's not a drip. It's not automatic. Every Wednesday, I sit down for 30 minutes and I create this report. Um, and so what I didn't realize is that through that weekly email, I was, I was beginning to start a personal brand. And I, I had no idea at the time, but looking back on it, that's what I was doing. Personal brand is what I've realized. It's something that we all need to be doing. But what it is, is it's, it's original content. It has to be, a, to me, it doesn't win unless it's original. If you have a company doing it for you, or if it's a drip, or if it's an automatic, it just does not, will not work. Original content from your brain, because that's giving them a piece of you. See, they're getting to know you through your content. And it has to be consistent. So, original, consistent content. The consistency of the content, and this is regardless of what platform you're, you're using to push this content. You know, it could be email, it could be social, it could be text, it could be even phone call, it could be what wherever your 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 platform is of building your brand, it's got to be consistent because it is an extension of who you are. If people see that your content is consistent, they're going to see you as a consistent person. You're dependable. You're hardworking. If you're inconsistent with your with your content, then they're going to see think that you're an inconsistent person, or that you're under independable, or that you aren't professional, or so on and so forth. So. Whenever I decided to do it every week, um, every Wednesday, every Wednesday since 2007, so we're running up on 13 years, never missed a Wednesday ever. That's through a lot of weird stuff. Um, vacations, changing hurricanes, markets crashing, you know, all kinds of stuff. Never miss because that's the single most important part of my business. So I, be I believe that the weekly email should be the foundation of your business, of your personal brand. And then you and then to me you build from there. So you got this consistent email going out. Okay, that's the first layer. And then the next layer that that's like that's your foundation of your house. Okay, your little personal branding house. And then the building blocks on top, you know, we can add social media there if we want. We can add text messaging, we can add all these different things, you know, postcards direct mail, um, you know, SEO, websites, uh, you know, advertise, wh whatever the case may be, I believe email is where it starts. If you can't get the foundation set and you start building your audience there, okay, um, that's just what I believe. That's what I think. I think that's the best avenue. A lot of people just do social media and they do really well and that's great. Everything works. Everything works. You got to find what works for you. And you got to be consistent and you have to you have to do it enough to to develop the skill right every everything is a craft you know and you have to get good you have it's a skill that you have to develop